Athena and Mateo Lee. Tonight, the search for the missing Sacramento siblings enters week number three. The children vanished shortly after their mother was found dead. Your reporter covering Sacramento County, Tori Apodaca, joining us now with the family's push to bring those children home. Tori. Yeah, you can imagine just how difficult it has been for Angelica Bravo's family. The latest information from the SAC Police Department here, believing those two children may be located somewhere in Southern California. And that's why the family has been going down there, posting flyers, trying to see if anyone has seen those two little kids. We want our babies back. And that's all we got left. The desperate search for four-year-old Athena Lee and two-year-old Mateo Lee continues after their mother Angelica Bravo was found dead in a North Sacramento home on July 8th. The latest news was just essentially there's no news. Angelica's mother Don Bodea says the latest update from Sacramento police are the kids are believed to have been dropped off somewhere in Southern California. Even though the SUV their father was last seen driving was caught on camera crossing into Mexico. A CHP endangered missing advisory identifies the kid's father, Cameron Lee, as a suspect in their disappearance. But SAC PD is calling him a person of interest they want to speak with. Regardless of the suspect's status as the father of the children who are missing, law enforcement has determined that these children are in danger. Local criminal defense attorney unrelated to this case, Candace Fields, says the SUV crossing into Mexico complicated the case because the U.S. doesn't have jurisdiction to apprehend there. But Angelica's family thinks had an Amber Alert gone out before the car was spotted in Mexico, they may have had their little ones safe at home by now. But at that point, it didn't meet Amber Alert criteria. It's really bad because my baby's lives are at stake right now. Possibly in SoCal, in uncertainty surrounding their safety. They're the only things that really have a spirit of my mom. Like they, they make me happy. Finding little Athena and Mateo Lee continues to be investigators' priority. We're all hurting right now. All right, if you didn't do this, come and talk to us, man. What's the deal? And you can certainly just hear the desperate plea from that family right now. As far as the death investigation, it right now is not being called a homicide, and that's because investigators here at SAC PD are still waiting on that autopsy report. As far as the family, though, they are just asking for anyone, whether it be in the Sacramento region or down in Southern California, if they know anything or see anything, to say something. And I wanted to also note, because it is being called a death investigation, that's why they aren't able to determine any suspects in this case at this point. Wow, so much more to find out, though, about mm -hmm. this case. Tori, just heartbreaking. Thank you for that live report.